Solo hard mode tob is the hardest thing in RuneScape outside of speedrunning. Take a solo tob and then multiply its difficulty several times over and you have solo hard mode tob. Each room is harder, less supplies are given, you need more supplies to complete a run, and Nihilocus Room is easily the hardest boss in the entire game, even over Awakened Leviathan. There's a good reason only a handful of people have completed one, and I didn't even think I would ever attempt to. Unfortunately, I would do anything for money, even something as torturous as this. What the fuck are you wearing? Why so aggressive to your queen? I don't understand. I mean, can we, can we just, we're done with this, right? We can just stop doing this. Any chance this isn't lost? Oh, but so is Maiden. Yeah, that's gonna seal it. I don't know if that's even sent. It's not. Okay. Zero? Through blood? Yeah, okay, we live in. Big streamer can hammer without defender, but when I do it, I get kicked by We Do Raids. Wow. Yeah, cringe. Am I right? World's longest maiden? Oh, uh, maybe? He got what he wanted. Unlucky. <laughs> oh, he's back. Sending a fat toy. Hello? Super. That's the wrong one. Fuck. Five grand. me live. Thank you. I love cream cheese. I have been told by my mother that when 9-11 uh, happened, I was in a high chair eating a bagel. And I didn't, I didn't cause it also because I was in a high chair eating a bagel. Tasty. It wasn't me. Okay. <laughs> not, I did not fucking do it. Okay. I was eating a bagel. 
There's a clear alibi, all right? There's witnesses. <laughs> you eating a bagel was the root cause. Unlucky. We have to find that bagel. <laughs> Seven minutes. I don't know why that took so long. It's really weird. It must be a glitch. Uh, or just really unlucky swings. I don't know what that's about. Anyways, Nylocus, it's free. Here, how many points? Nine points. Okay. Surely. Nylocus is all about priorities and making the best possible move at all times. Hitting the wrong Nylocus in this room, unlike regular Tob, damages you for eight damage. So spamming Blood Barrage isn't going to work. We still try to protect the bottom right pillar like regular solo Tom, as all four pillars dropping kills you on the spot. There are three demi boss spawns, and I will basically be using them as cover from Nilo aggros the entire time. Not only preventing damage, but meaning I don't even need to kill them. Moving a demi boss to a bad tile on accident instantly ends a run, as all the aggros can just reach you. I've taken a lot of damage. The absolute highest priority is killing any aggros. Off prayer hits from these stack up very fast as they max over 20. I'll always try to pre-fire any Nilo coming down that will attack me. The biggest priority in this room is killing the small Nilos eating the pillars, as a pillar dropping too early sends all of them after you and you can't feasibly tank all of them. Anytime I can pipe Nilos, that's my top priority, as that is by far the best weapon for killing them. Melee is by far my best style for DPS, so I always try to toss it a swing when possible. My next priority is pumping damage into the demi boss. It needs to die at a specific time, and it needs to be low enough so I can finish it when I need to. Finally, keeping health as high as possible is the final priority. Blood blitzing, barraging, and pipe specking are all I have to keep my HP up. When the third Demi is about to drop, I need to clear enough Nilocus out of the room so he actually spawns. I try to pull all the aggros from the fallen pillars to the far end of the room and tank them and then run through the boss to get them stuck. Hey, I think we're good.
Okay. Sorotseg is basically the same as in regular Tob, except you have to tick eat two bowls. It's a zero supply room, since I do this flicking pattern to reduce prayer usage. That's not ideal. Flick it up blood for your heal to 11. That'll do. a little bit in case. Huh? Okay.
Peace. Okay. To Zarpus we go. Zarpus is also very similar to regular Tob, except there's far less space to work with, meaning you have to play perfectly. Zarpus fires poison splats at random tiles in the room. Because we have the entire sides covered, the poison can't go there, giving us less space to work with. I had to go learn how to back tile in entry mode, awkward. which is a really awkward attack pattern, allowing poison to be placed a little more freely. Once I'm out of room, I just keep doing the walk underneath him, kind of similar to Vespula. If I didn't play well enough, I would run out of prayer. Luckily, I hit every hammer and played well enough to get through the room. I could go use those tiles, I'm just gonna keep doing this. We dropped the sand feet. Unlucky. I think it'll be okay. Period. Okay. We're through the bat. Assuming I don't troll. Should be enough supplies to get it. Maybe a little tight. I have a sand few too, so 
I think we're good. Cringe! After Screech, I just do a single attack and wait for him to turn towards me again until he dies. The bat is dead. The bat is dead. Okay. We have an extra five doses of prayer. You can use P1, P2 if needed. If you need to, can redempt lightning when you get low. It maxes 14. All right. How many, um... You want all the... How many restore do you need going into Verzik? These three, maybe? Five extra doses. Ideally. I will be using this. I will be using this. Three for P3, nice, for no flicking. Okay. Two shield charges for reds. Okay. Tick hitting for 25 minutes, not in hard mode. <laughs> we have to kill the boss. What? Okay, this by the sweets is good. Don't need the Tebow. That's where you're wrong, fella. Okay, I think we're good. Drop the Tebow if you don't need it. I dare you. I need it. Anything else to sort? I'm trying to think. I think we're okay. Divine when I start P2, yeah? And then go from there. I think we're good. Yes? All right. I think we're good to go. P1 Verzik is the same as regular solo Tob. I just alternate sides because she drops rocks around the pillars. It's a little scary because if I take a mage hit, it can hit over 99. Go up and do one cast? I think so. Oh, this is unlucky. P2 Verzik is very different from regular Tom. That lightning now only maxes 14, meaning I don't need to constantly tick eat it. Her bombs drop poison, so I need to avoid ragging the crab pop tile.
At 35%, only one red crab spawns instead of two, meaning I can do the fight completely normally without ticketing for 15 minutes. Please change regular solo top to be like this, Gagger. I'm forgetting to use my shield. That's fine. Okay, we use it now. We'll be okay. Send it? It's fine. 
Kill her. No! I'm doing it. No way. It's fine. Okay, we're in. P3 is just an extremely long, normal P3 fight. I need to make as few mistakes as possible so my supplies hold out, and use Ancient God Sword specs where I can for health. This green ball redemption is the same as a tick eat, but it only works with redemption, not eating normal food. I take my blood fairy off to prevent healing as I swing at Verzik, as this can prevent redemption from going off if I heal too much from it and kill me.
he's almost there. Damn it. Not quite. Trolling? Stop trolling. We got it. Everything's fine. Brain active. Should be it. Okay. <laughs> Ain't no way we just slip in the quick little completion. Ready to the whole way. <laughs> Oh man. Okay. Long live the queen! It's just that easy, boys. It's just that fucking A easy. Leech has spawned. Yeah, we'll do the we'll do the Toa thing. I think the chest is right here. Wait, what? Ain't no aw, oh, no purple. Ain't is that it? Well fuck this fucking game. 400k. <laughs> Sci-fi with the 100 gifted. Thank you so much, man. Puggers. Zero deaths. No monkey. Overall time, 1.11.48 and a tick. Uh, I, I will sum up the solo hard mode Tob experience. Um, it sucks. It sucks really bad. Maiden sucks. Maiden's RNG, whether you even get through the room. It's like a it's like a two and three chance. And then there's Bloat, who's just six minutes of nothing. And then there's Nylos, which is actually like interesting, and it's probably the hardest thing in the entire game. And then and then Sodit Seg is just he's just he's just normal Sodit Seg, but he got two balls. Zarpus is crazy. I love Zarpus. Zarpus, but with limited tiles, holy. He's hard. And then Verzik. We like Verzik. We win! It's winnable! 